hello everyone this is everlasting and welcome back to my channel today we're going to be watching the slam dunk season one episode two last episode was really interesting um it was quite a very funny pilot arc um pilot episode hanamichi is just quite an interesting protagonist right it is interesting to see how should i say this someone who is quite a he's like a yankee and we have him as a protagonist this is quite interesting i'm i'm super curious as to how he's gonna progress as a basketball player and so that's just that direction i'm so excited for this yep rukawa kaide Okay, is he good at fighting? He's a basketball player, so he must be physically fit. Hanamichi versus Rukawa? What do you mean by that? Are you gonna have a basketball match or are you physically gonna fight? <laughs> <sighs> we'll kick their ass, okay? Hanamichi and Yohei, are they gonna go? Oh, they're not involved. Oh, oh. What are these more so excited about? Mm. <gasps> oh! Done! He managed to finish them off! It's 3v1, right? 1, 2. Ota? <gasps> so 4v1. And he's splitting. Hmm. Probably. Oh no, Rukawa. Yeah, that's the guy. Oh, calm down. Yeah. Don't aggravate him. Oh my god, this too. I mean, this tree. No, 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 no. Ask questions. Don't assume. Oh, no. You hate him? I mean... Oh, no. Yeah, you got the wrong idea. It was hard. He didn't even do anything. At least not yet. Oh my god, this music. I mean, she already fell in love with him before he even got involved with her. Yeah. You should go to the infirmary. <gasps> yeah. Ouch. No, 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 no. Don't do it in front of her. Oh my god, now you really... Who cares about Sakuragi? Yeah, 
Yep. Ah, uh, I mean, you said you've never really introduced yourself to him, right? What a wimp. Hmm. Will he meet Haruko? What is this music once again? It sounds so angsty. He's shut down. <gasps> oh no, basketball. Uh, red hair. <gasps> so he's really quite infamous within the school now, even though even though he's just a freshman. Aremasenka. Oh. Hmm. Who's? And the captain of the palace. And it's this crowded. Iron. How tall are they? He doesn't. <gasps> what the heck are they wearing? Tuxedos. Oh, it, they're making it such a big deal, oh no, and everyone's watching, it seems like. You stole the ball from me, and score one, so one shot. Hmm. <laughs> What's wrong, Sakuragi? Oh, you're remembering the past. Look at that pink tinted. Is that the heart shape? It is. Yep. It's because I'm a sportsman. <laughs> And Rukawa's here! Yeah. Oh, who's gonna win? Did that Hanamichi actually think? <laughs> Hopefully he does have a plan. What will you do? The motion. Wait! You shouldn't... You can't kick the ball in basketball. Yeah, you can. That's a foul. Is that common knowledge? Is, is he your brother? Oh no! That one off the wrong foot. Gorilla. <laughs> Monkey. Octopus. Oh my gosh, Shakuragi, you know how to piece people off. I'm I must say. Oh my god, this is a public humiliation. Are you gonna leave? 
Turns out you just keep on messing with the wrong guys. Yeah. Oh. Will Haruko come? And he's not even wearing basketball shoes, right? Well, Haruko's brother is wearing uh, a sport shoes. So, Sakuragi is actually <laughs> battling against Haruko's brother. And Haruko's brother is the captain of the basketball club. So, that means he's definitely older. At least third or second year. Most of the characters that I've, or rather, most of the anime shows that I've watched, their captain are usually third years. Okay, so I'm thinking, uh, Haruko's brother must be at least, at, must be third year, but he's so tall. He's way taller than Hanamichi. Like, you can you see the difference? Hanamichi had to look up to him. That must be the first time that Hanamichi actually had to look up to another person, right? I mean, even Rukawa, they're about the same height. But, um, Haruko's brother is way taller. Wow. I'm thinking. Position-wise, he must be a center. He's way too tall to not be a center. I mean, there are tall forwards and... I mean, there are tall people in other positions, but usually the tallest player and the bulkier ones are on the center, right? So it makes me think that he must be a center. Though, correct me if I'm wrong. I'm really looking forward to seeing what's gonna happen with this. Hanamichi had challenged... Uh, Haruko's brother into a a basketball match. Even I mean, him kicking the ball. It was a surprise the moment I first saw it. But then my mind went into the fact that he didn't even know how to dribble it the first time he touched it. Right, and even though I do not play basketball, it is common knowledge. But that just shows. I mean, it is common knowledge that you have to dribble it and you cannot use anything other than your hands to touch the ball, right? But it just shows just how, how should I say this? Just how far away Sakuragi is <laughs> that he doesn't even know that, right? But it is quite curious. I wonder what's gonna happen with this. Rukawa even went. I'm surprised. Like, Rukawa went to see the match. Must be because he's fighting off against the captain and maybe he was curious about the captain's ability but he did see sakuragi so he was maybe since he thought he saw that he was tall maybe he thought that sakuragi if he doesn't know if he doesn't know that sakuragi was a yankee like uh, haruko did then maybe he thought that sakuragi might be a future teammate because he is a basketball player right so he's definitely bound to become part of this basketball team and so that's how they're gonna fight along with uh, Haruko's brother, right? As a team, we've seen three out of the five starting members that we see on the ending credits. So we haven't seen those two members yet, but I'm really looking forward to seeing how they're gonna be introduced. I have a feeling that since this is going to be at least a hundred episode, it makes me re it makes me really think that this is going to be a slow burn. So it's quite nice that they're actually taking their time and. That means I can actually adapt faster probably because lesser information because they're just, how should I say this? They're not condensing it in one pure episode. So I'm really happy that that's the case here. But yeah, um, I really enjoyed this episode. Rukawa, uh, so he's quite strong as well, right? He was able to handle 4v1. Unfortunately, Sakuragi just keeps on messing on the wrong people, right? First Rukawa and then second is Haruko's brother. Like, everything that he everyone that he shouldn't really target he did target right he's so unlucky but yeah um haruko um the moment that he she sees it like i can understand why right um rukawa's been known to be a good basketball player right i remember he, he her saying that she scored like 41 points or 51 points during um a basketball match that she watched of him and so she must have thought that if there's a 
if someone's at fault between those two, of course, the one with the better reputation would be the one who's going to be pointed at, right? So I guess it's understandable now. At first, I was just, I was just like, you should have asked questions. But then if you think about it, with Sakuragi's reputation, it only makes sense for her to think that way, right? But um, it is quite surprising that Haruko, despite being so shy in episode one, right? He says, she says that he, she did not really confess or something like that. But then she's quite active with Rukawa here. And you can just see her being so shocked that, Rukawa doesn't even know her but then I do remember if if I'm correctly remembering it please to correct me but I do remember her saying that she did not even introduce herself so why is she so shocked right hmm but yeah um, I really enjoyed this episode I hope you guys did as well thank you guys for watching and I'll see you all on the next episode for Slumdog bye everyone